Joel, welcome back. Thanks for coming on. It's a difficult situation, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, feels like the film Home Alone. <laughs> yeah, tough. I'm not feeling my best. No, no. <laughs> Are you on tour at the moment? Yeah, very soon. How many dates? Well, my last one was about 130 dates. <laughs> so it's pretty extensive. Now, aren't you writing books as well? Yeah, that no, was good. It did all right. Did it? Yeah, got in the bestseller list, and that was enough. We're quite happy with that. That's another box ticked? Well, it's a box ticked, and it's also a present to give to people forever. So... <laughs> the hardest thing I've ever done, I think, up until doing The Chase. But, well, uh, this yeah. is your second time on. Oh, I love this show so bad. Do you? I mean, now it's a very dire situation for me. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I mean, I just want my mum to be proud of me. What's your mum's name? Penny. Let's make Penny proud. Here we go, Joel. Thank you. The time starts now. Someone in a difficult situation is said to be up the creek without a what? Paddle. Correct. Which German-born scientist said God does not play dice with the universe? Uh, uh, don't pass. Albert Einstein. Ian Richardson first played the politician Francis Urquhart in what TV drama? Uh... Pass. House of Cards. In what country is a native of Birmingham called a Birminghamian? In what, sorry? In what country is a native of Birmingham called a Birminghamian? UK. USA. Which famous Roman was murdered ten years after his second raid on Britain? Caesar. Correct. Which Northern Irish golfer won the 2019 Players' Championship? Rory McIlroy. Correct. When Those Guys Come Back, I'll Be Ready is a line in what Macaulay Culkin film? <laughs> Home Alone. Correct. <laughs> what type of celestial body generates energy by nuclear fusion? <laughs> that have been star. <laughs> Joel Tomic, four grand. <laughs> Time, Joel, to face the chaser. Good luck, mate. Gorgeous Joel. Hello, it's... gorgeous Vixen. <laughs> it's just you and me left now. Exactly the way I planned it. <laughs> Brad, <laughs> can you go off and make a cup of tea or something? Yeah, I'll go and make the tea. I'll go and put the kettle on. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Four on the table, three steps ahead of the Vixen. No offer, please, Jen. £1,000. Thank you. High offer, please. Let's you and I make some really great telly. £150,000. <laughs> I pretend to be you for a second. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is so good. Well, you know the rules. Yes. If you now go out, you all come back and you choose who you think is going to be the best player, and if they end up beating the Vixen on their own, you get two grand each for your charity. So it's eight grand, OK? It's pointless going down the middle. What so do you want to do? I feel, personally, like there's better people on that team than me Ooh. to chase the chaser in the end. I don't know about that. I feel like I should just go for it all guns blazing. <laughs> Make some great Teddy and Penny proud. Yeah, look, I'm <laughs> All right, there you go. Brilliant stuff. Joel, well done. You. You're going to top in 150. Happy? Oh. I think that is exactly the right decision. Oh, absolutely, it is. Everyone's behind you. The chase is on for 150 grand, everyone. <laughs> I wish you well. Here comes your first question. Good luck. Come on, John. The surname of which nursery rhyme character is the same as the married name of a Spice Girl? A. Little Jack Horner. B. Little Miss Muffet. C. Little Tommy Tucker. <laughs> oh, you've got to. You know this, don't you? You've put Little Jack Horner. It's Jerry Horner. Isn't mm. it? She's from Watford. Yeah. And. <laughs> <laughs> She's married to the Formula One boss of the Red Bull team. Oh, I Christian didn't know Horner. that. Correct answer is. <laughs> Got it. Well played. Well played. <laughs> okay, goes right. Here's your next question. After the United Kingdom, what is the next largest European kingdom by population? A, Belgium, B, Spain, C, Sweden. B, 
Yeah, he does. OK, you've put... It's got to be Spain. Right. I mean, it can't be Belgium. There's only about five people in it. <laughs> <laughs> Correct answer is... Yes! I really did have to think about that, though, because yeah. Belgium's a lot smaller, but it's much more densely populated than Spain is. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, I get it. There's more people in a smaller area, but yeah. not so many people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Settle Down. <laughs> Here's your next question. In 2019, Swiss scientists discovered that playing what genre of music to cheese gives it the funkiest flavour? <laughs> A, hip-hop, B, classical, C, rock. That doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> You've put... Hip-hop. Well, it felt like the funkiest oh, because classical's three. completely unfunky mm. and rock's completely unfunky. Hip hop has a uh, bass in funk, I suppose. Correct answer is. Come on, please be right. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Goes also hip hop sticks with us. Two behind the three from home. Here's your next question. Which of these was the title of a controversial Missouri newspaper launched in 2018? A. Mars Telegraph, B. Saturn Echo, or C. Uranus Examiner? <laughs> oh, I think this is one that everyone knows and I don't know. You've put Saturn Echo. Silly boy. The correct <laughs> answer is. Oh. It's Uranus Examiner. <laughs> Staying where you are. Chaser's put. Goes right, Uranus Examiner. Keyword there being controversial. There's not really much controversial about the names of the other two newspapers. Yeah, OK. Three from home, Chaser's one behind. Here's your question. Come on. In 2016, who became the first British track athlete to compete at five Olympics? A. Mo Farah. B, Christine Ahurugu, or C, Joe Pavey. Wow. <laughs> oh, you've put Joe Pavey. I think Joe Pavey is just an incredible runner. I ran a 10K once, and she was just, like, running beside me, just like, yeah, how are you getting on? I was just like... <gasps> <laughs> so she was amazing, and I think she's, like, a legend for doing it for a while. Correct answer is... Yes, well played, so close to home. Oh, wow, this is close, this is close. Chase is close. Chase goes Joe Payton and sticks with us. Two from home, 150 grand. Had you taken the £1,000, you'd be home in the final by now. Here we go. Which of Henry VIII's wives lived to see the coronation of Queen Mary I? A. Catherine Howard. B. Anne of Cleves, or C, Catherine Parr? <laughs> Need an answer, Joel. You've put Catherine Parr. I went for because I hadn't heard of her. <laughs> and I felt like I was more likely to have heard of ones that had been killed. <laughs> but I don't know whether the other ones were killed or not, but... <laughs> Basically, I don't know. <laughs> Correct answer is... Oh, no. You're staying where you are. If the chaser puts Anne of Cleves, you're out. Think she knows it? Yeah. yeah. Chaser's put. Oh. Oh! <laughs> still in, you're still in. You're still in. <laughs> OK. All right, here we go. That might be the turning point of the game. Here's your question. The five hottest years on Earth since 1880 occurred in which decade? A, 1990s. B, 2000s. C, 2010s. <laughs> You've put 2010s. Global warming. It has to be. Correct answer is... Yes! Chaser has 
<laughs> OK. Now then. 150 grand hangs in the balance. It's the highest amount ever offered to a single player. Joel Domit, I wish you luck. Here we go. <sighs> Who were the first animated couple to be shown in bed together on US television? A, Fred and Wilma Flintstone. B, Peter and Lois Griffin. Or C, Popeye and Olive Oil. Need an answer, Joel. This is a lottery. You've put Fred and Wilma. Yeah. yeah. And imagine the stone bed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> to go through with 150 grand, the correct answer is. Added to black coffee to make it cafe au lait. Bell. Correct. The astronomer Galileo was born in what country? Italy. Correct. In medicine, by what other name is ultrasonography known? X ray. Ultrasound. Diego Schwartzman plays what sport professionally? Uh, pass. Tennis. The English alphabet contains how many letters? 26. Correct. Violinist John Clark died on what ship in 1912? Uh, Titanic. Correct. In 2019, which Duchess moved into Frogmore Cottage? Um, uh, uh, Meghan Markle. Correct. Pyramid Song and There There were hits for what UK band? Coldplay. Radiohead. Sorry. Bootykins are worn by babies on what part of the body? Uh, uh, feet. Correct. Which former First Lady's memoir has sold over 10 million copies? Michelle Obama. Correct. The island country of Mauritius is located in what ocean? Um, the Indian Ocean. Correct. Mrs. Johnston features in what Willie Russell musical? Uh, past. Blood Brothers. How many minutes do the clocks go back in October? One. 60. What disease is often abbreviated to TB? Tuberculosis. Correct. The Shavasana, or corpse, is opposed in what activity? Uh, past. Yoga. Who played Donald Gleason's wife in the rom-com About Time? Um, um, a pass. Rachel McAdams, to divulge a secret is to spill the what? Broth. Beans. The pardoner's tail appears in what work by Chaucer? Uh, pass. Canterbury Tales. What character did comedian Al Murray create in 1994? Pub Landlord. Correct. Which female singer's hit Bad Blood featured Kendrick Lamar? Bad Blood. Uh, Rihanna. That would have been Taylor Swift. Bad luck. <laughs> Tough on your own, man. Brutal. There were so many in there I could have got. Tough for a single player. I could see you lost your focus just a little bit in the middle. Yeah. But you were getting there at the end, you were swinging again. Absolutely. Joel, 11 steps ahead. Now then, if the chaser gets a question wrong and Joel gets it right, he will push the chaser back one step. It is now time for the final chase. <laughs> Chase your time starts now. A Manhattanite is a native of what city? New York City. Correct. What <laughs> confection by Ferrero has a hazelnut at its centre? Ferrero Rocher. Correct. The Sony Trinitron was a brand of what household device? A television. Correct. Which Ivory Coast footballer announces retirement 2018? Um. Cissé? Stop the clock. That is wrong. Which Ivory Coast footballer announced his retirement in 2018? Didier Drogba. Correct. We push the chase for that. Well played. Great answer. Okay, nine to catch. One forty remaining. Your time starts again. Now, who is the second wife of Prince Charles? Camilla. Correct. What animals take part in the Jim Carna? Horses. Correct. The Prodigal Sons, a 1905 work by which French sculptor? Rodin. Oh, correct. Danish drummer Lars Ulrich founded what heavy metal band? 1981. Metallica. Correct. The gullet transfers food from the mouth to the what? Stomach. Correct. What is the British equivalent of a US round trip ticket? Return. Correct. Santiago is the capital of what South American country? Chile. Correct. Who played the title character in the TV comedy drama Fleabag? 
Phoebe Waller-Bridge. Correct. And wet rooms are typically built in what room of the house? Bathroom. Correct. 